Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode of The Vegan Point. In today's episode, we are going to be looking at two shades from Kat Von D's new studded cream lipsticks. As you guys all know, she has her liquid lipsticks, and then she has the other studded lipsticks that are matte, and um, I just felt that I really wanted to get a shade from her cream uh, lipstick, and I got it in two shades. So the one that I'm wearing is um, Backstage Bambi, and um, even though I'm wearing it on my lips, I'm gonna show it to you and so here it is and in the box um, it actually says vegan on it which I really think is awesome and uh, let me swatch this so that is backstage Bambi and like I said, I also have it in a go-go, and it's an orange color, and I'm excited to have an orange um, lipstick just because I've never owned one before, and so for me, it's like something new, so I'm going to swatch, and so there is a go-go, and I think her, her formula for these, like, feel very light but yeah you could see that there's good pigmentation to it and she also has other colors um, and she has like some of her well-known colors from her other lipsticks that she had made in the cream version and we are gonna actually take a look at some of the other colors just so you guys could um, see the other colors. So we're gonna take a look. So please be patient with me. Um, let me ref oh, there it is. So there's Lolita, which is one of her well-known ones. Um, OG Lolita. Muñeca. Lolita 2, Ophelia, Bow and Arrow, which she has also, I've seen it in liquid form, Double Dare, Ludwig, Sanctuary, which looks very pretty. Cathedral, Hawkwin, Lovecraft, Mother, Outlaw, Underage Red, Adora, Hexagram, which is really pretty. Nosferatu, which is another one that I really like. Um, Misfit, Gold Blooded, Agogo, which is the one that you guys saw me swatch. Backstage Bambi, which is the one I'm wearing, and Crush. So when I was at Sephora, I had a, a hard time deciding on which one to get because I couldn't get all three and I was a little sad to have to like say no to crush because that also looks very pretty too um, there's Coven Ozzy Roxy Love Mercy Prayer, Crucifix, oh, sorry, Vampira, Motorhead, Homegirl, 
Yuff, I cannot pronounce that word, so pardon me. Plan 9, which is a green, and that looks interesting. I've also never owned a green, so that's something in the future that I might want to see what that looks like on me. In zero, which is gray, and that definitely is something I want to try. Po. Um, I cannot pronounce that name, so I'm not going to try, but it's a, it says it's pitch black with gunmetal glimmer and slayer and whiteout, which is used to like customize uh, another shade with. So those are the colors at the time being. Also, I wanted to show you guys um, on her website, there's a section that says Vegan Alert, and it tells you all the other products. So here you see the cream lipsticks, and then you'll also see the Glimmer Veil, and then her metal eyeshadows, and she has a couple of duos. Then she has um, the Farm Sanctuary liquid lipsticks which is one that I do want to make a video on as well. Um, her foundations. Yeah, some of them will veil her perfumes. And yeah, I definitely love that about her page is that there is a section that says vegan alert and it tells you all the products that are vegan and what I also like about her brand is that um, she is working on having her entire line vegan and it is nice to see a main stream brand that's in Sephora be vegan and I want that in the future I would I want to be able to walk in into Sephora and not have to worry about like what's vegan or what's cruelty free because I my hope and expectation is that everything in the store will be cruelty free and will be vegan someday and I want that day to be sooner um, rather than later so I'm gonna support somebody who is working on making their entire brand vegan and who is cruelty free so that's one of the reasons I like her brand. As well, like I said before, um, her products are just good. I love her liquid lipsticks. I love her tattoo liner and her brushes. Um, and I love these. So yeah. But anyway, um, that is all it for today. And thank you for joining me. If you guys found this video to be informative please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe and thank you bye